Well, definitely whenever you share memories, that's a very powerful thing. From now until June, when we get back, they're always gonna have these memories to share and they love sharing those memories. So if you wanna really get your students to really foster a community, Wolf School does a wonderful job of that. I like the campfire. Like all the songs and all the skits were like really exciting. And I like hiking. The hiking part was fun because you get to see things that you never saw before. Like I never saw a banana slug before. So it was really cool to see that and like just like see nature up close. When you're learning about like a salamander, like you just like see it in a book. But like here, like you can see it in person, like you can like hold it. The reason why I love Wolf School and why I believe in outdoor education is it kind of levels this playing field. We serve students from all over the Bay Area, from diverse areas and neighborhoods and communities, and they'll come from their schools and their neighborhoods and come to camp and have this experience that really allows them this opportunity to grow and learn and explore and be a kid. My favorite time at the at, uh, Web of Life Field School is uh, going to the newt pond. We got to catch three newts, we put them in a bucket and we held them. The Wolf School is a place where kids can start to see and look around. They can see what it means when everybody has a great meal to eat, what it means when they always have someone who's looking out for them, where they got a whole cabin group of people who have their backs. It's a place that they can call their own. It's an experience that they can call their own. We operate at different sites throughout Northern California. We have two sites here in Santa Cruz, one where we're at right now at Monte Toyon, the Redwood Forest, another at Little Basin, which is part of Big Basin Redwood State Park. We have a site in Casadero, which is in the Sonoma area. It's over a thousand acres. There's waterfalls, different types of habitats that the students get to explore. We have a site in the Sierra Foothills, which is a lot more chaparral based and oak woodlands and then our we have a site right outside of Yosemite at Camp Tuolumne Trail. A big bonus of coming to the Wolf School is that students not only get to have this week of outdoor education but we can also go off-site and take them to one day field trips. So here in Santa Cruz we usually head down to Natural Bridges State Beach where we can explore the tide pools, look at the monarch grove, talk about erosion, do sand crab studies, be really active. We head into Yosemite Valley where they're now down in the valley floor again looking up at this beautiful glaciated valley that's been created. They head to Hetch Hetchy where a lot of their water comes from those that live in the Bay Area and San Francisco area, and they actually get to see the differences between Yosemite Valley and Hetch Hetchy Reservoir and just make those connections for themselves.